Hey everybody, it's Isaac Rendell. I am super excited to be playing back again. It's been such a long time since I've actually been able to get on this world. I've been editing and putting up videos that Serendipity and I have filmed a while ago. Uh, but yeah, super excited. We are in Minecraft 1.19. I still have other videos that are going to come up before I do anything uh, spectacular in this version. But I do want to get it up uh for you know letting you guys know how to update your worlds like i always do uh, or like it, what i always want to do when it comes to updates like this and so it is june 22nd 2022 and i'm going to go in here here is our world that we play in and i'm going to go ahead and hit edit and i'm going to hit make a backup that needs to happen every time so backup made yes we are good so what we're going to do now is close out of this and we're going to go into MCA Selector. And we are on versions 2.0.1. So here we are, MCA Selector. And uh, what we're going to do is go into File. And I will have a link in the description on how to download this. Uh, I'm going to go into File, Open World. And I'm going to the name of my world, which is Immortal. Go here and just hit Select Folder. Hit OK. And you're good. Here is our world. This is everything. I've always been so amazed with this. And you use the was the key, the was the keys, the the W A S D, uh, the same as uh, when you're playing Minecraft. But check this out. Here is here's our whole world. So here's Toby Hall right here, and the villager breeder and our sheep farm, which is amazing. I can't wait for you guys to see that. Um, but yeah, check this thing out. Uh, if you go far enough, this is everywhere we've been in the world. That's, that's it. That's, that's it. Everything else that's not filled in is just all that potential that we have not been in, all the things that have not been loaded. Um, we are going to go ahead and... Oh, there's our Mushroom Islands. I have such a great plan for those. Uh, this is Serendipity's little area that she's working on. And uh, we are going to go through here and uh, decide what chunks need to go. All right, so the way that I like to handle this is uh, start off here with our actual base. And this might mess up some underground work that we're doing. So I'm going to overestimate things a little bit. But I'm going to left click and drag down. And I'm just going to try to cover everything that I want to keep like that in orange. I'm going to do a little check around, make sure that I'm not forgetting anything. Little things that I might have pop, pop, uh, popped up. The, uh, the, the amethyst cave that we have, um, any place where we've, we've gone, um, adventuring at any point in time. I don't think there's really much. This is all stuff that we've gone out checking, but, uh, it's nothing that we've, uh, nothing that we've really done anything with. I just want to be 100% sure. After you get everything that you want, Figured out that you want to keep chunk by chunk. I think this is when I went on a little adventure looking for villages and couldn't find anything. I can't believe we have not done that much with this world. Uh, I'm going to hit selection. I'm going to hit invert selected regions. Just like that. And everything that is not highlighted now is what's going to uh, be saved. So I'm going to go ahead and... Just do this. Because what I would really like to do is make sure that our world is all prepared for this new amazing update we have. So everything else has not been loaded in yet. So that should all be safe. Next, I'm gonna go ahead 
and delete the selected chunks, which is under selection. Delete selected chunks. We're about to delete a lot of chunks. <laughs> Here we go. And there, that's it. That's our world. That's all we have left. So let's hop in and check out to see how it looks. Okay, here we are. We are back in our world, which has been completely chunk divided. And uh, you can tell with a little bit of stuff that I'm pretty sure we're going to have to... Uh, I don't know. I think the biggest thing that I'm worried about is we're going to have to check underground to make sure that uh, I didn't screw up too much. I don't think I did. Everything should be within the boundaries of what I had chosen, what I was uh, wanting to keep. Um, I think, I think, think that uh, the part that might be the most changed is going to be anything that's further out to the side. So we should be good. I think some of the, um, maybe some of the, uh, the under areas, the, uh, the, the abandoned mine shafts might be a little bit uh, snug where it comes to a few things, but I'm not too worried about that. Um, I'm more worried about just the stuff that Serendipity and I have built together. But we are currently in the wild update, and that is amazing. I have one more major thing that I want to check before I feel 100% comfortable that I did not screw up anything. And that is underground, where we are planning on putting an underground village uh, for masons. All right, this was what I was concerned with. I thought I might have clipped off the the founding fathers' room over here. Let's see. Oh, carpet duper still on. <laughs> let's uh, let's turn this guy off. And uh, we have so much work to do down here. I am so excited to see. Oh new recipes we can build some new stuff there are so many things we need to find a mangrove swamp definitely needs to be found a um uh the deep dark itself we're gonna eventually have to find the warden but uh just just so everybody knows and so nobody's disappointed uh serendipity and i are probably not going to be rushing out there and doing anything crazy right away uh we kind of want to just enjoy this world and um and see what we're going to accomplish as time goes by because we have actually done quite a bit in our tiny little area and eventually we are going to run out of room we're going to have to check new things we've got a big wall of things to do over here which uh, we're going to have to add to now because we're missing a type of wood in our in our in our tree farm now. Gosh, this looks amazing. All right, yeah. That's uh, that's a lot of stuff that we're gonna have to get through. Um, but I'm sure we will get around to it. Anyway, that is really all that I wanted to do today. I just wanted to help you guys out with trimming the chunks to keep your world young and uh, make it so that you can continue playing in this blocky world that you call home. So, I'm Oz Grendel. Thank you for joining me with this little, uh, I guess, MCA tutorial that we've gone through. And I will see you next time. Bye.